Hey, what's up team? Princeton here. Um, just wanted to shoot a quick video um, going over what your uh, general your general um, mission will be after I get you fully trained up and things like that, and um, basically have you just like a you know a general you know idea of uh, of you know what what you're supposed to do for your uh, for your mind to be able to wrap itself around and just basically you know go from there with that in mind. So. Um, Today's video is going to be over, be over uh, booking while prospecting, meaning um, you guys, you know, um, everybody on my team is a CTC and everything like that. So basically, w once you're, you know, you're done taking your CTC training and, you know, making that money and, um, you know, uh, making your money from booking travel and things like that, be sure to take uh, some of that money and uh, reinvest it back into your business, meaning uh, reinvest some of that money back into your, you know, your, um, your ad lead generation and um, basically use that money to help expand your reach so you can, you know, bring in that many more prospects because, um, in network marketing, the real money comes from, you know, team building. So you, you really, really want to focus on that more than anything. But as far as, you know, for some of you guys just now getting started and not, you know, um, uh, you know, just, just needing money right now, um, you know, I, I highly recommend you start booking. But um, if you if you know, say for instance, if you're investing in something else and you don't want to, you know, spend that money you're investing, um, or you know, putting away um, in a in a savings account or something like that, then I suggest you you know you you book uh, travel every here and there, and um, use that money to re reinvest back into your lead. So basically, any you know extra cash or anything you you can you know possibly have or things like that, because it only takes you know. Ten dollars to get your ads, you know, um, up and running, and then uh, you know, be able to, you know, uh, test whatever, because you'll you'll have you'll have three up um, at first. It only takes ten dollars in each, and then after you know um, a little period of time, like say seven days, um, whichever one's getting the most activity, shut the others off, and then take the money that's still left over from the other two and invest into that that one getting the most activity. So um, you, you really want to, you know, um, just really, really, really take whatever, you know, spare, loose change or whatever and just invest it back into your leads because, I mean, into your uh, your ads because, I mean, the more the merrier. So, um, I mean, say, for instance, if I had $10, um, you know, extra cash or whatever, and I wanted to put it back into my business and my, and my, ad, lit, my ad lead generation, then, I mean, for all I know, that ten dollars could turn into a hundred thousand. So I mean, you know, because um, I mean, ten dollars will bring in a lot of ads, and I mean, not a lot of ads, a lot of uh, a lot of leads. So you really, really, really uh, just want to, um, you know, really crack down on that. So um, that that's basically your basic mission. So be sure to uh, book travel, invest any spare money you possibly have into, you know, back into your your ads. And um, you know, help generate that many more leads, and keep you know, keep adding to your team, keep keep building. But um, as far as um, you know, team building goes, is very very lucrative. And um, you know, you um, a as I was saying, um, you're gonna you're gonna need um, you know, at least uh, with with the company you know we're marketing right now, um, vacation. You're gonna need at least ten people, at least ten generals, at least you know. Your 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 big ten, so um, uh, you you want to really really do that, and um, like I said, the best way to is by your ad uh, lead generation. But um, you know, if you if you have uh, team members, I mean not team members, um, family members that you know um, that I mean. Obviously, though, you know, you know them and things like that, and you know, you can trust your network too. Then I, I suggest you add them to your personal big team. So, um, but if anything, be really, really, really careful about that. Honestly, you need at least 30 generals, really, because I mean, like I said, um, network marketing is a numbers game. Um, so, you say, for instance, if you if you had uh, your big 10 already. And you um you know you uh you already uh you know um you got them trained up and things like that, but you only have that big ten, 
then um, let's say for instance if one of them quit and that just made your network fall apart you, you don't need that um, I mean that's not that's not what's going to happen but I mean say for instance if you had 30 generals and you know one of them did quit then one of those you know uh, those other generals or whatever would replace that person eight and uh, you would have 29 if anything but I mean like I said the more the merrier have at least between 10 and 30 generals and I mean if you if you had 30 generals then I mean it is what it is then I mean you you're you're making <laughs> that much more money so um, that being said guys just really 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 be careful about you know who you bring into your network and you know who, who you're you know trusting all your secrets through me to and you know just really 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 being cautious about you know how that specific individual would um you know play out in the future so really really you know keep your head on the swivel and um just you know really really take into consideration the outcome um so general overview overview of this uh, video book while prospecting and be careful about who you you bring into your network to become one of your big ten and that concludes this video